The Calgary Peace Bridge, a mini-documentary produced and narrated by Ryan Olenek as a project for EdTech 533, YouTube for Educators. This course is part of the Masters of Educational Technology program at Boise State University. The City of Calgary in Alberta, Canada is located just east of the Canadian Rocky Mountains. The city will ever be for rem remembered for the 1988 Winter Olympics. They are also known for the National Hockey League's Calgary Flames and the world-famous Calgary Stampede. Calgary is home to over 1.2 million people, of which many are outdoor enthusiasts. There are over 10,000 hectares of parkland and nearly 500 miles of bikes and walking paths. It is also known for incredibly modern and environmentally friendly structures. One such structure is known as the Peace Bridge. The Peace Bridge is a pedestrian bridge that accommodates both pedestrians and cyclists built to cross the Bow River and connect the Southern Bow River Pathway System with downtown Calgary. This connection is designed to accommodate the increasing number of people commuting to and from work and those utilizing Calgary's pathways. The bridge opened up for use on March 24, 2012. The City of Calgary wanted the design of the bridge to follow strict requirements. These requirements included no piers in the water, an effort to minimize the ecological footprint, and a restricted height. The bridge also had to be designed to withstand the one in a hundred year Calgary flood, a minimum 75 year lifespan, be total accessible for all people of all mobility types, and to provide comfort and security with see-through lighting. As you can see, this bridge really is bridge beautiful. It provides an exciting way for thousands of Calgarians to cross the Bow River west of Princess Island Park. This structure is no ordinary pedestrian bridge. It has been specifically designed to create a unique landmark which is functional, environmentally sensitive, and architecturally superb. Construction began with the steel fabrication of the oval helix structure in Spain in 2010. Sixteen segments were produced and then shipped to Canada. Around the same time, the project's general contractor, Graham Infrastructure, mobilized on site and built the temporary structure across the river to assist in the launching of the bridge, drilled piles, and constructed bridge abutments. Next was the building of the assembly pad to aid in the construction. After the steel helix segments arrived in Calgary, the contractor lifted and aligned the pieces onto temporary supports. An enclosure was built around the structure to provide controlled conditions. This allowed for all 16 segments to be welded together. The Peace Bridge is over 6 meters wide, double the width of other pedestrian bridges in Calgary, and provides a clear separation between pedestrians and bicycle traffic to enhance safety. Access to both sides of the bridge is barrier-free for people of all mobility types. Throughout the entire construction process, quality assurance played a key role in the development of the bridge. The fabrication of the precast deck panels took place early in 2011. In the summer, the structure was removed from temporary supports and the installation of the glass panels began. A total of four coats of paint were used to ensure its long-lasting nature. The bridge is designed to meet a minimum 75-year lifespan and withstand Calgary's 1 in 100 year flood cycle. In the late fall of 2011, the bridge structure was launched across the Bow River. Hydraulic jacks were used to slowly push the 850-ton structure on rails across the temporary bridge. Once across the river, the bridge was moved sideways and lowered into its permanent location. The bridge can be used throughout the year because of the canopy-styled glazed roof which allows for natural light. Specialized lighting from one end of the bridge to the other allows people to safely use the structure 24 hours a day. The Peace Bridge enhances Calgary's Bow River landscape and continues the development of the center city into a dynamic, mixed-use urban hub that provides a safe, attractive and energetic atmosphere for residents and visitors to Calgary. The Peace, Peace Bridge, Bridge was originally called the Calatrava Bridge, named after the Spanish architect Santiago Calatrava, who designed it. 
As you can see from these other incredible structures, the design of the bridge is a departure from his normal work. His designs are typically asymmetric shapes anchored by high masts and are all mostly white in color. The Peace Bridge features red and white as used in both flags of Canada and the flag of Calgary. Criticism started right from the conceptual design and the look of the bridge. Many people thought it was an ugly ducking in an otherwise beautiful pathway system. People thought that the downtown would look horrible with this bridge at the foot of the core. The video that follows was the conceptual 3D design of the bridge. There were other criticisms as well, mainly financial since the bridge was constructed during the height of the recession. First was the cost of the design. Calatrava and his group were paid an astounding $3.9 million for the architectural and structural design of the bridge. The next complaint was the fact that it was single sourced and given to a foreign firm. People of Calgary contested the fact that there was no competition for the design of the bridge. They thought this was definitely not the Calgary way. The finished product is an architectural marvel. Not only did it succeed in meeting all requirements of the City of Calgary, it withstood the Calgary flood of 2013. The flood tore apart downtown Calgary, but left this bridge safe. The bridge is now used by more than 6,000 people a day and is becoming a meeting place for all tourists and local Canadians. It's, you know what? It's busy. Look at all it's the busy. People. people using it? People mm -hmm. using it? Yeah. yeah. So, uh, it's, I mean, it's very different from anything yeah. Calgary has. Yeah. Sure at 